we are solamente in the biblioteca que tienen dos cuerpos in the tierra. It's our first time here. <laughs> from the Getty Museum who made our pool and our garden. Mm. And it's an English garden. It's the same on both sides. That's how, how it is. This is called the Apollo area. Who, who was the first man on the moon? Uh, Neil. Neil. Second. I don't know. <laughs> Buzz, Buzz Aldrin. Buzz Aldrin, yeah. These are the actual molds from the boots that were on the moon that he wore. No way! Yeah, and he came here and walked in the cement. You can walk in them. Get walk. out of here, really? Oh, well, well, yeah. And everything's a theme. I'll tell you why. Well, wow, he's got <laughs> long legs. I got short legs. <laughs> well, <it's only> <laughs> well, big feet. Yeah. <laughs> All of this has a theme. This is the Apollo. Mm -hmm. Because where did, who's the only president that had a man on the moon? Hey, you. <laughs> All the descriptions are on there telling you if it's a T Rose hybrid, whatever. Yep. All of this is to honor Buzz Aldrin. Mm -hmm. He walked here in peace for all mankind. So he comes here. <laughs> Going up the corridor, the newest rose for him is called Celestial Knight. Mm -hmm. So Celestial Knight also lauds or gives him praise, okay? Mm -hmm. So every place we go in this garden, there is some symbolism with the roses. These are starting coming out now. These are Pat Nixon roses. Oh. Pat, oh, okay. Oh, my the other side is the same. La rosa de la esposa. Okay, es la jardín del mismo por otro lado. Okay. Exactly the same. Okay. These are Mr. Lincoln, the most famous rose in the garden. Wow. Mr. Lincoln, of course. <laughs> that is the gazebo under which um, Tricia Nixon Cox got married. Oh. And underneath there is the most highly scented, most beautiful smelling rose mm. in, in the world. How many children did Richard Nixon have? Um, two? Two girls. Yeah. Joel and Tricia. So, in the garden here, both roses on the same side, like I told you, it's the mismo. Mm -hmm. Okay, on otro lado. 
daddy's little girl. Aww. And see, we got little roses. Now, this is very incident. Check it. Mm -hmm. This is the Catherine B. Loper Center. This is a block of Aquia Creek sandstone, quarried on Government Island, and it was removed from the new United States Capitol. Ooh. The White House was also built with Aquia sandstone. This was given to us <clears throat> for our ground baking ceremonies in 2003, and wow. I was here when they were building this. Nice. Feel this. Now, do you know why they call it the White House? Because mm, it's white? It, it was burned, and all the beautiful sandstone got black, oh. <coughs> and they didn't want to take it all down. Mm -hmm. <coughs> they painted it white. This was built and given to us by Bob and Dolores Hope. Wow, mm -hmm. Bob Hope. And this tree and that tree came from Hearst Castle. Let's go a different way because I want you to go on. We'll see that last. Now, all of these roses are called peace roses because President Nixon's philosophy was peace and prosperity. And these are peace roses. And you know where they came from? Mm -hmm. Germany. Germany. During during Hitler's reign. Are you oh. serious? <laughs> when President Nixon died, Bob Dole, you know who Bob Dole oh, is? Yeah. 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 He gave the eulogy. Okay? Oh. And these are veterans honor roses in his name. Now, anybody have a twenty dollar bill? Uh, we did. <laughs> but then we went to the garage sale. <laughs> <laughs> We're garage sale freaks, so we spend all yeah, our money. Bill. Mm -hmm. This tree mm -mm. is the only tree that is a descendant of. Look. Come here. Uh -huh. so you can, that's why I want you to have oh, this. Yeah. These are magnolia trees at the mm -hmm. White House. Ooh. They're gone. They're oh, gone. Yeah. Pat Nixon brought a cutting from there and it grew. And no, we had it here. really? And it was um, where the East Room was and then we moved it and it didn't like it there. Mm. So we brought it here and it likes it here and look at it, it's growing. Yeah. And, growing. and it's the only, only descendant of those trees at the White House. Oh, so God. this house mm -hmm. is where he was born. A family lived here. So that's it. Oh. It's, it's nothing has been changed. And mm -hmm. listen to this. His in his family, his aunt took when when they moved, took all the furniture and everything and put it in Newport Beach. So when we opened the little house, we were able to even put the bed where he was born. No. In this house. It's that mm -hmm. original. This house and this tree were both planted and built in 1912. This tree should be with the alive. This is a belladonna lily naked lady. Oh. <laughs> I always tell the men, don't tell your wife you came to the library to see a naked lady. Exactly. <laughs> it's a cutie. <laughs> that is the little house. One bathroom, and four boys lived upstairs. Oh my God! Well, and then one died. At oh. Twenty-three. Oh. And then another one died. So, by the time they moved, they had three children, three boys. Yeah. Richard Nixon and his two brothers. Mm -hmm. This man was here when they built the house. It's so old. It's called. Yesterday, today, and tomorrow. Because in tres días, diferente color, and then uh -huh. all over again. And I had, this is the first time it's bloomed. It's this so year, beautiful. So, yeah. so one day it's 
One day it's white, the next day it's lavender, and when it's ready yeah. to dye, it turns white. You're kidding! And then it starts all over again in three days. Whoa! I like that. And they have no, they have to use all. So they kept ice and things in that little area there. Yeah? Ice. Yeah. Oh. This is the memorial. Mm. We are solamente la biblioteca que tienen dos cuerpos en la tierra juntos. Yeah? Yeah. Oh. Oh. What? They're buried here. <laughs> You're kidding. Oh, and who is it? They're, uh, they're here. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. El su esposo. In the, in the mm -hmm. tierra. Yeah. What? Solamente. Crazy. The roses behind there are called everlasting love for them. That's awesome. Mm -hmm. Everything mm -hmm. I told you has a symbolism. Tree roses. I had no idea he was here. Mm hmm. This cypress tree is 500 years old. Yeah. yeah. It's, it's getting very old. I don't know if they're going to have to take it out. They no. had some branches fall, and oh. I don't, you know, nobody wants to get hurt. Yeah, yeah. 500 years old. <coughs> I see a little bit of green in there. <laughs> Save the tree. <laughs> okay. Very important. Who stopped the Vietnam War? President Richard, Nixon. yeah. We had 240 Vietnam vets here three mm -hmm. years ago. We got them all uniforms, everything. Had the same dinner that they had in the White House when they came back. Mm -hmm. And this, I took a symbolism. This memorial was to the Vietnam vets. These roses are all a tribute to them. This is Let Freedom Ring. I don't know how to say that. Yeah. Let freedom ring. Mm -hmm. These are all, all for the Vietnam. Mm -hmm. Okay. And these are fake. This is the same. The same weather vane that is on George Washington's house. Oh, wow. And that uh, Nixon used to entertain. Mm -hmm. So it's the same. And if you go to, you will see this. And see if there's a dozen piece up there. And uh, it's an exact replica. Mm -hmm. Let's see, the tea roses are on one side. And then flor abundance are more than one on a stop. See? Mm -hmm. All of these, and they're beautiful ones. Yeah. Okay. They're called first kiss. First kiss. First uh -huh. kiss. Cute. And then this is our first lady's garden. Mm -hmm. Okay. <laughs> Pat Nixon, Lady Bird Johnson, Rosalind Carter, Nancy Reagan. That's why I say that wow. Yeah. Nancy Reagan, and this is Betty Ford, and that's Barbara Bush. Oh, Betty Ford. Everything is the old and the new, because this was the old farm, nine acres, which we bought back. And then we just bought this new fountain. Oh. So everything, when you stand here, you think the old and the new. Because the library is brand new. And all of that is like it was. Oh, I want you to come here. And 
Go Ooh. inside the gazebo wow. and smell the roses. Those roses are the most fragrant roses in the whole world. Go in. You can go in. She got married under this. His other daughter. Oh. Daddy's little gold rose. Wow. <laughs> Okay. This one's called Abraham Darby. Mm -hmm. The whole group is called David Austin Race. Wow. But this is Abraham Darby. And it's one of the nicest of his roses. OMG. Isn't that something? I know. And when they're all blooming, it just comes out like perfume. So beautiful. Oh, wow. Oh, yeah, great one. Abraham These are called Abraham Darby. The, the one that developed the smell and everything was uh, David Austin. Famous, famous oh, okay. rose breeder. Yeah. In England. In England. Wow. Beautiful. Beautiful. <laughs> now wait. Wait a minute. Stands right here. Mm -hmm. Okay. Oh, in line. In line. Like in line. Cute. Yeah. Now turn around. Ahora volteate. Turn around. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, mira, yo te mira. Qué bonito. Wow. These are cristal realidad. Es para luz. Cuesta mucho dinero. How many pieces? Oh my god. 500 pounds. Oh my god. 500 pounds. They are real crystals. Difícil para Now, este cuarto es exactamente como en la White House en Washington. Pero más grande. Oh, okay. Más grande en men. Because, ¿por qué? Nosotros have many, what's wedding? Bodas. Bodas, bodas. 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 that's right, bodas. bodas. Have many bodas aquí. Mm -hmm. Now, esta, oops, esta es George Washington. Uh -huh. La mujer es Martha Washington. All of the mantles are from one quarry in Italy because we wanted them exactly the same as the White House. So wow. this came all the way from Italy. These are called columns, fluted columns. That at the top is sculptured from those acanthus plants out there that I showed you, the green plants. Yeah. They're the oldest plant in the garden. So at the top, see the flowers? Yeah. That's the acanthus. And it's the same as the East Room in the White House. Oh, okay. Okay? Yes. Now, you are on your own. You can go to a helicopter. Okay. You can walk around. Thank you. And you have my last tour. Thank okay. you so much. Yeah. Thank you for your time. Okay. We learned a lot. We really appreciate it. So glad you okay. came. Okay. Thank you.
It said that the security guards see a blue mist here. Can you show up for us? Uh, I think it's a green mist. Green? green. A mist. Just go over there. We're gonna go investigate by the house and by where they're buried. Pat and Richard. Let's see if we can see some kind of mist. Maybe we should ask a security guard if it's haunted here. Let's see it over here. Yeah. It's very serene here. Okay. No, you see ground right here. This is the resting place of Patricia and Richard Nixon. Richard and Patricia, uh, if, uh, if you are here, if both of you are here, can you please say hi? My name is Carmen. I came to visit. What's it like growing up here? Was it really crowded upstairs with your three brothers? Do you like all the roses they have here for you, Patricia? Or do you go by Pat? Did you like the fact that they buried you here where you grew up? You're next to your wife, Pat. Does that make you happy? I know. Mom's really enjoying the flowers. They're beautiful. Um, the security guy left. I wanted to ask him if he's seen anything. I think he's over by the helicopter. Do you still hang around here, Richard? Mr. President Nixon? Did you enjoy your time as president? Was it very hard work? Why do they, people say they still see you here? You see that lady over there? Touch her hair. Now, if she says she felt something on her head, then I'm gonna... <laughs> That's good evidence. <laughs> nope, she didn't. She's leaving. <laughs> so, Richard, you lived here, Mr. President, with your brothers and your family. Your mom and dad. Your mom, your dad built this house. 
What did you think about that? Did you have fun here when you were little? What is your favorite room in the house? Too bad the house is closed so we can go in there. We can't see anything in there. Anybody here? Do you visit here? You like being around the trees. So beautiful. Mom's over here. She's tired? Yeah, she's tired <laughs> from walking. It's so pretty here. Did you guys learn anything from your fort? Yeah. Or... Yeah, all of the all of the roses were they all have a theme. Yeah. And that Pat loved roses. Yeah. And then they all have their own like all the first ladies. Well. Maybe not the Democrats again. <laughs> 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 so they don't want the roses here? That's what she said, I don't know. How long have you been working here? Since, uh, oh. We actually came here because, um, I said, uh, we read online that it could be haunted because... <laughs> so we're like, okay, well, let's check it out. So you guys are, are the ghost strangers or something? Yeah, okay. Alright, have you heard of Strong Town? What is this called? So I used to work before I started working here. Yeah. And down here there's a, a hospital called Rancho Los Amigos. Hmm. And across the street from Rancho Los Amigos, it's, a, it's, it's county property. And there's something that supposedly is haunted or something. Uh, every week we have people, oh, it's going to be very much haunted. I know when I first started working here, a friend was like, hey, I read online yeah. that it's, it's haunted and uh, that at night the security comes haunted with, uh, with uh, Richard Nixon. I'm kidding. I'm never, I'm never going to talk about it.